Okay, they're trying to make it like it's not a big deal with the Mark of the Beast. Um, <clears throat> but the, the fact of the matter is they're just kind of hiding it from us. Um, because people in Sweden are, you know, currently allowed to take the Mark of the Beast. I guess you're allowed to anywhere, but um, people in Sweden are taking the Mark of the Beast. People in China are taking the Mark of the Beast. Um, and to get such a number, even in the hundreds or thousands of people taking the Mark of the Beast, they must be doing something um, to encourage them to take the Mark of the Beast. Um, so they're trying to get us to calm down, I think, right now is what's going on, because it's still basically, it's an emergency for all the Christians, because they are still giving out the Mark of the Beast. Um, they don't want us to freak out about it. Um, so they're trying to introduce it slowly, I think, but, um, it's still coming this way. Um, it just hasn't hit yet because so much about coronavirus is taking place in the news. Also, the coronavirus is taking place over the Mark of the Beast. So even though the Mark of the Beast is still out there and it's still an equal threat, it's not appearing to be a threat because they're busy talking about the president, they're talking about coronavirus, they're talking about all the stuff on the news. Um, so anyway, that is what they're focusing on, and we need to focus on something else. We need to focus on the fact the Mark of the Beast is out there.